Looks good. Are you filming? All right, this is a Pro Mag Marlin uh, 70 round drum. I got to load it up with Winchester Super X 37 grain bullets. We're going to give it a try. That was 100% perfection right there on the Winchester Super X 37 grain bullet. Absolutely no jams, failure to feeds, or failure to ejects. That's good right there. All right, Marlin 70 round drum by ProMag. This time we got a Remington Golden Bullet uh, 36 grain uh, hollow points. That was a failure to fire. The bullet had a bad primer, apparently. Once again, failure to fire. The bullet's primer was bad. It's not the drum or the gun's fault. That's clear. The drum and the gum function flawlessly, except for the two failures of fires, which was result of the ammunition and not the drum. All right, Marlin Pro Max 70 round drum, and this time we got a Federal 36 grain hollow points in the 550 value pack. So here we go. And that's clear. We had uh, no problems with the Federal 550 value pack with the drum or the gun. Seems to work flawlessly so far. That's good. All right. Uh, we got the Marlin 795 with the Pro Mag 70 round drum again. Uh, this time we got a full of uh, Federal match grade uh, 47 or 40 grain bullets. So let's give this a try here. That's all 70 rounds, function flawlessly once again. It is uh, performing perfect. So this is the ProMag um, Mar A4 70 round drum for the Marlin 795. It's basically made of a black smoke colored plastic. And for a long time, users of the Marlin 795 and other Marlin magazine fed rifles have been looking for a bigger option than the standard 710 round magazines that Marlin's been offering and this one as you've seen by the video works great um, it works a lot better than the Ramline Champion magazines that's been on the market for a long time and those generally have bad reviews um, as seen in the video it does work great and ProMag also offers this in a 25 a 30 round and a 55 round magazine or drum this is the 70 you're looking at right here um, some of the things I like about this drum is that it's uh, got clear plastic, uh, clear smoke colored plastic around the edges so you can visually confirm the round count as I show you right here by the side you can kind of see through it and then it also has um, an internal round counter here 
I don't know if you can see this on the camera, but as you crank the uh, load assist, it's got a round counter door right there that tells you what exact round that you're sitting on or firing at the moment. And um, another great thing is that it has a bolt on the outside that's followed by a nut on the inside that you could um, disassemble the magazine for uh, cleaning or just general servicing. Um, it's also made in the USA. It's covered by the ProMag Lifetime Warranty. Some of the things that I didn't like about the drum magazine was it's pretty big and bulky. It's very much well bottom heavy. Um, that could oppose a threat if you ever drop this while it was loaded in your gun or apply any kind of pressure or force to the left, right, or bottom of it. Um, the part that actually sticks into your magazine well doesn't seem very well constructed so I could see it easily breaking off inside of your gun um, and that's also another thing I didn't like was uh, feed lips was not constructed of metal it was made of a real kind of cheap plastic so I could see that becoming a problem over a long term use um, and just durability factors was not great with it um, Promag has this drum listed on their website for about $112. I ended up buying this one off a of gun broker for about $99. And I'd say the value is definitely there. It was worth all the money I spent on it. It works great. And it is a great option compared to the 7 and 10 round magazines that Marlins offered. And pretty much your only options that you've had over the last few years.